This 3100 SE by Maxim is not just a great looking cruiser, but she's packed with features to add more value to your boating dollar. The 3100 is Maxim's boat with twin engines for greater maneuverability and has the converting V-berth which enables you to seat a lot of people on the inside yet still have the versatility of two separate sleeping areas. Underneath the skin of this sexy cruiser is a well thought out floor plan that provides space, comfort and amenities. This modern cruiser offers expansive cockpit seating and a cabin that guarantees a relaxed atmosphere, preparing you and your guests for a many memorable weekends afloat. Let's begin with the impressive cockpit that is made up of two separate lounge areas. Forward on the port side is a large L-shaped settee that blends into a relaxing chaise lounge. The aft seating is comprised of a generous U-shaped settee with enough room for up to a half a dozen of your favorite shipmates. The stern supplies pure functionality with a locking transom door and a wide swim platform. Inside the roomy transom locker is enough space to stow all your fenders and lines. Forward in the cockpit is a wet bar. It comes complete with a pressurized freshwater faucet, a deep sink, and enough cabinet space below for an optional refrigerator or ice maker. Except for the standard Mare Cruiser controls, the helm station is first rate especially when ordered with the optional navigation and communication equipment from Raymarine. The top tier of the dash supplies all the critical engine instrumentation, while the lower tier has all your accessory power switches nicely labeled. The European styled sports steering wheel is very plush and is adjustable with a tilt column, as is the captain's dual helm seating that features a nifty bolster seat mechanism. Molded into the helm console are several steps that lead to the foredeck. Maxim ensured that the SE had large forward sunning area with removable snap-in pads for all you sun gods. One of my favorite aspects of this deluxe cruiser was the anchor locker. Beautifully concealed under a large hatch is an electric windlass, the windlass control switches, a mooring cleat, and a deep anchor well. I think you'll be pleasantly surprised to see how accommodating the SE's cabin is. Come on, follow me down. Three steps down and you're in the SE's plush salon. A comfortable sofa invites you to relax and enjoy the good life. The owner's bunk is located aft in the mid-cabin. Here you'll find a wide berth located near the boat's center of gravity. Located to starboard is the cruiser's head compartment. Inside is ample room to use the sink with vanity, the flush toilet, or the shower nozzle. Topping off all these amenities is the galley. Equipped with gloss maple cabinets and brushed silver toned hardware and appliances. This cruiser offers a comfortable beam of 10 feet 6 inches and an overall length of 30 feet 9 inches. We found the 3100 SE to be a stable entertaining platform thanks to her weight of 10,800 pounds with the standard engines installed. These standard engines are from Mare Cruiser and produce 220 horsepower each. Pushing the SE's throttles to wide open, we recorded a top speed of 40 miles per hour at 4600 RPM. Throttling back to 3500 RPM gave us a cruise speed of 28.5 miles per hour. The boat produced a solid ride at this speed and delivered 1.3 miles to the gallon. This will stretch your cruising range to a leisurely 180 miles before having to refuel the cruiser's 150 gallon fuel tank. Despite the cruiser's obvious size, she handles well once on plane and carves turns crisply at top speed. The 3100 SE is ready and waiting to take you and your guests on a luxurious weekend adventure.